Hi, this is Dominic with Fair and Square Roofing, and today I'm going to talk to you about one thing I hate, poor metal work from builders. So you see all this here, this has been leaking for a couple of years. Uh, be nice, I did this as a free fix for someone I know a couple of years ago. This sort of solved the problem, but the real problem is below. So soon we're going to figure out what's under here. We're going to uncover this, remove some siding, and fix this whole thing. So no one ever has to come up on this roof again to fix this. built the false wall so nothing can get in behind here. We put ice and water shield around the whole perimeter of the chimney. We put it up the wall, up the whole siding because I want to do things properly the first time and never come back here. And we also built a bit of a mini saddle here so when water goes down here it's gonna go down here and then also drain right away from there before it was actually getting into the hole and leaking down into there. So we'll show you final pictures later and then we'll be all done. Here's our lovely chimney that we're working on. So as mentioned before, there's ice and water shield on the whole thing, wrapped up every wall. We have very large wings to divert the water away. Another wing here to make sure that this isn't leaking, which it's not, and ice and water shield on our false wall. Got all this metal here diverting it away from here, so this will never leak. And once again, another job well done. So we wrapped uh, self-adhering ice and water shield underneath all this metal and siding and shingles. That's the first thing we did. The water, the chimney was waterproof at that point. Also what we did is we shingled around it, added three back pans there, a false wall here. A back pan is a large piece of metal generally used to divert water away from, some, from an area. Uh, we have one here, one here, and one here. And with our very, we have them with our very large wings also. And this is not gonna cause an issue. 